Hey, champ. I've been meaning to talk to you about a potential big opportunity. Is now a good time? Yeah, sure. What's going on? So far, you've been living up to the office's expectations. But now it's time for a big test. We want the lock to headline a live event for the first time, defending the Intercontinental Championship. A live event? I'm not sure that's a big test. Let me finish. The live events in one of our top markets, L.A., where there's always a lot of competition for the WWE Universe's entertainment dollar. It takes a big name talent to put butts and seats there. You know, like when I main evented WrestleMania 12. Wasn't that in Anaheim? Technically not L.A. Nothing gets by you. Anyway, if you can sell out a major arena in L.A., you can do it anywhere, even Anaheim. So what do you think? I think I'm more than ready. Let's make it happen. Great. We thought we'd let you choose who you want a main event against. Sami Zayn, Ridge Holland, Austin Theory. We can just promote your appearance without an opponent. I'm confident I can sell out the event on my own. No need to announce an opponent. The WWE Universe will pay to see me beat anyone. Bold decision. I guess we'll find out. So, big live event coming up. Do you feel extra pressure knowing that same night The Rock will be in L.A. promoting the premiere of his new movie, Mudslide? I don't know why they didn't call it Rock Slide. It was right there. That's news to me. And to be honest, that does raise the stakes a bit. The Rock's a huge deal, obviously. But I think there's room for both of us to succeed that night. Or at least I hope so. I should mention that it's not just a typical movie premiere. Rock's giving away a hundred brand new pickup trucks and anyone who attends is eligible to win. I heard fans were lining up weeks in advance. Look, it's gonna be fine, okay? When the bell rings for my match, those seats will be full. Got it. Oh, and just a heads up, I might be a little late to the show on account of the fact I need to cover a friend's shift waiting in line for a truck at Rock's premiere. But I'll try my best to catch your match, too. <laughs> Got it. Thanks. The following contest is scheduled
champion, Chris Payne. So, how'd it go out there? The match went fine, but in case you didn't notice, the arena was only half full. So, not great. What do you chalk that up to? I thought I could sell out the show on my own, but maybe I got overconfident and bought into all this lock hype. Or maybe it's just tough to compete with The Rock giving out free trucks. Who knows? Well, well. If it isn't the Intercontinental Champion. I remember my first IC title, but barely. Because Losing I... your memory in your old age, huh? So sad. <laughs> wow. Locke's got jokes. And I was just about to teach you everything I know about being the Intercontinental Champ. Enlighten me. To be a true Intercontinental Champion requires a truly Intercontinental skill set with mastery of styles from all over the world. And your intercontinental specialty is... British? Japanese? Lucha? Cleveland? No, no, no. I am the greatest French-style wrestler of all time, of course. A style defined by the element of surprise, or as the French say, surprise, with a zzz, which they stole from me. Are you sure about that? My wife is French, so I'd know. But enough spelling talk. Let me show you what the Intercontinental Championship is all about. In the ring, for your title, what do you say? <sighs> sure, but I've got more important business first. I've already got a cage match title defense lined up. Well, bon chance, as the French would say. Break a leg, or two. An impressive win over Madcap Moss. Here comes The Miz with a shot to the back. What the heck is he doing out here? And now The Miz is asking for the cage to be lowered down. This is absolute mayhem. The champion just survived a cage match, and now he's dealing with this? The champ's doing his best to battle back, but Miz has played the element of surprise to perfection. Can the champion capitalize on this opening? Low blow from The Miz. 
The most unpredictable man in sports entertainment has struck again. And again, and again, and again. Talk about a long night for the Intercontinental Champion. This is brutal. The man destined to be top dog. It's the lock. The following is scheduled for. Here comes the boat of WWE. And his partner from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Natalia! A third. Well, misery loves company. a wonderful couple because they have so much in common. Title reigns, reality television, six... The Intercontinental Champion has teamed up with a North of the Border superstar tonight for a mixed tag team match against WWE's marquee French couple, Miz and Maurice. Hold on, since when are the Miz and Maurice French? I wouldn't second-guess Miz Saxton, not when it comes to maneuvering his way to another Intercontinental title. Watch and learn. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Oh, boom! Gut wrench suplex. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. This is just brute power. What a German suplex. Wow, what impact. Oh my, dragon screw targeting the ankle. About to be the proverbial one-legged man in the you-know-what kicking contest. Twisted into a leg breaker. Maurice's hopes are waning. Maurice needs to find an opening fast. And able to beat Natalia to the punch. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, and Maurice turns the tables. Ah, oh, she's trying, trying to create space. Driver, wow! Out of the way in time. A stalemate of counters. Oh, what a clothesline. Ooh, she just turned it around. Maurice with a great shot. There's a special word that I can't say on air for that type of slap. Hey, keep things T for team, Corey. Ooh. 
Uh-oh, this is not going to be good. Oh. Punishing the leg. Leg trapped. Looking for the heel hook stretch. Ooh, that's going to hurt. She's starting to drag a little bit. Yeah, this is exactly why constant, frequent tags are so important in a match like this, to keep fresh. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And Natalya has taken control. Yeah, and now he's proven hard to keep up with. One response after another, back and forth we go. She avoids the attack completely. Oh, boom. These guys have been looking to beat each other up for a while, and now it's their chance. Leaping into the wheelbarrow, up and round into the DDT. Cover! And he only stays down for a one count. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. Oh! What's he going to do here? The foot DDT! Nice calf kick. Great elevation. He tags out, so now the women are going to go one-on-one. -on -one. Earled away. God. Able to interrupt the attack. Oh, the heel hook. Stretch. She tagged out, but if you ask me, I think her opponent wanted a break, too. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker. Here's a cover. Could be it. And the count stopped short of two. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. His opponent included. He takes control. Ooh. Shot to the face gets them out of that spot. Yeah, would you stop? Miz has him measured up. Scores the reversal on Miz. And stop. Driven into the mat. It's over. have to do to put this guy away. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Off the top. Diving, Diving. arm drag. I like yours better, Cole. This is just brute power. German. Just pure dominance. Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. And just got caught with that DDT. He's in a little bit of trouble now. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? And he throws the opposition back into the ring. The Miz at the complete mercy of his opponent. Yeah, Miz is having trouble fighting back. Miz counters with an attack. Right, A defensive elbow to the gut ends that. Mm. Ooh, man, what a hit. Nice arm drag. Miz in a very vulnerable position here. The Miz caught off guard. The Miz just got destroyed. Five star frog splash. Locke has him staring at the lights. And there's the save. Let's keep fighting. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Cover. He breaks the ref's count before two. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. Boom, what impact. Reigns down an elbow. 
elbow in retaliation. Oh, setting them up. Canadian Destroyer. Typical guy hiding behind his woman. Right on the chops. She's looking for the win. And she breaks the count. I'm happy she did. I don't want this match to end. Cut off with a sweep. Uh-oh, this is just vicious, vicious arm stop. Uh-oh. Look at this. Look at that torque of the leg. Oh, leg breaker. And her leg has been targeted a few times now. Ooh, look at her answering back. With the reversal. Well, this is the tire's wheelhouse. The Hart family legacy lives on. Sharpshooter apply. Think so about all the pain she's in right now. There's no shame in giving up now. Running Swanton finds the mark. Very unique escape to fight her way out of the sharpshooter. Nasty kick. And that holds Maurice back. A oh, timely counter by Natalia. Natalia with Natty by nature. Natalia thinking she can close this one out. This could be the beginning of the end. Uh-oh. Sharpshooter applied. Tap out. Wow, got it. Big time tag team win. Here are your winners. Chris, Payne, and Natalia. Now we know who the better man and woman are. What a mixed tag match. I wouldn't have expected these two to perform well together, but they looked impressive in victory. Congratulations on nothing. That win was completely meaningless. What matters is that I still have an icy title shot. Care to make it French rules? Here we go. What does that even mean? It's the highest form of unpredictable surprise-based sports entertainment. A proper cage match with escape-only rules. Are you intercontinental enough to handle it? Call it whatever you want, Miz. It's clearly just a pathetic attempt to find an advantage that you will desperately need. Bad news, though? I'm keeping this Intercontinental title no matter what fake French surprise you have planned. Bad news? No way! I'm clearly in your head, which is the best news. Say au revoir to your championship. The following contest is a steel cage match and is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. It's the man who might transform WWE forever, The Lock. And here comes one of the most decorated competitors in WWE history. An A-lister of sports entertainment.
Introducing. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for the dramatic conclusion of the head spinning saga between the defending Intercontinental Champion and The Miz. That's right, Michael. The Lock will defend his Intercontinental title against The Miz in a French Rules cage match where the first competitor to escape the cage will walk away with the IC title. Sit back, butter your baguettes, and enjoy two of the best in the business with the premium in premium live event. Fighting back against Miz. Running Swanton, awesome. Oh my God, Springboard Moonsault, wow. Oh, this isn't pretty. They've got their opponent's arm. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Oh, man. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Half kick right on point. with the Bulldog. The Challenger eating up some damage. Hooked up, DDT! Uh-oh, second rope. Moved out of the way. Nobody home. Boom. Drop kick! Oh, Swanton! From the middle rope, oh, what a splash! And Miz now finding himself on the wrong side of momentum. Miz needs to rely on his resourcefulness. Oh, what a counter. Opportunity now for Miz to capture the momentum. But he still has more work to do to get this fully in his favor. Oh, right in the solar plexus. Brutal stomp to the body. And, oh, and then the chest as well. The Miz letting him know who the real star... Oof, he gets what he deserves for all that gloating. Inverted crush. Oof. He knows how to avoid contact. Oh, a strong impact. He's making his way up the side of the cage. Five star frog splash! Can it be? Will the rain continue? Uh oh, second rope. Guys, oh, that might be the best moonsault ever. I agree. Fortune favors the bold. These risks could be a winning strategy. You love to see it, just strolling right on out through the front door. The struggle is on, can he escape the cage? Can he make it a little bit further? And not so fast, my friends. The champ taking their share of hits now. And Locke got out of dodge. with a neck breaker. Oh, God. Open the door, Rat. Open it up. This is very interesting. Come on, we don't have all day. Relax, he's got it open. Oh, no. On oh, a reverse DDT. <laughs> Out of the turnbuckle. Overhead suplex. Stopped them in their tracks with a kick to the gut. Oh, and that buys some time. Big forearm.
Here's a wheelbarrow into the DDT. This won't be good for Miz. But champions need to finish the job. Believe it or not, it looks like they'll simply be walking out of this cage. And here we go. He's headed up the cage. And the champ retains. Here is your winner, and still WWE Intercontinental Champion, Chris.